Hello, everybody. I am here to participate in a collaboration hosted by Rebecca at Farmhouse at Meta Hill. It's the Star Spangled Hop. And there are 13 of us, I believe, that uh, is participating. And after you watch my video, you'll hop on over to Susan at Susan's Cozy Condo. The link will be below. Each one of us that is participating will have the link of the person that you'll go to next in our description box. So thank you all for being here. This is a patriotic collab, hence the Star Spangled Hop. And I'm doing the cupboard in the kitchen, and I hope you enjoy seeing my patriotic touches. First, I'll show you what I have down below. There's that cute little white chair that John painted that we got four of them at uh, a yard sale. And I wanted mine painted. And I don't have anything in the little bubblegum machine yet. I'm going to put some patriotic something in it. I just haven't had a chance to do it. And I do have my two cute little patriotic towels on the doors. And then, of course, John has to have a truck. And there is a little cherry pie and a Lee right there. And in my two-tier tray, I have some vintage cherry pieces. There's that beautiful hand-painted plaque with the cherries, one of my vintage creamers. And then down here in the bottom, that's that adorable little cherry cup and saucer that I got um, at a yard sale a few weeks ago. Then there are the cherry salt and pepper shakers, vintage ones that we've had for a very long time. And there's my old mashers or beetles. And then over here, in the back of the cupboard, I have my blue and white transfer wire plates. The two in the center are the oldest ones. I have my little vintage yellow wire bowl with some cherries in it. And there's that sweet little cow creamer that I got this past week at the yard sale. And that wonderful white ironstone wheat pattern pitcher. And there is the dough bowl with the chicken in it that I got at a yard sale a few weeks ago. And of course, you know I'm going to have to have some of my Anna Lee's out. There are some Ray Dunn pieces and this Uncle Sam's hat, salt and pepper. Those are vintage also. And there's the little white ironstone restaurant dish that I got and it has raspberries in it. I'm going to open up the doors so that you don't get a glare. On the bottom shelf, there's that cute little salt and pepper shaker set that we got at a yard sale last year, and more sweet Annalise. And on this shelf, the same, and there's the little oil light that we got um, several weeks ago. This is another adorable little vintage set of salt and peppers, the little dog and the little pups. And up here on the top shelf, some more of my vintage salt and pepper shakers along with the sugar shaker with the sailboats on it, red, white, and blue. And of course, this is one of my favorite series in the Ray Dunn collection. And down here, there are the salt and pepper and the cruet. And there's the little crystal cruet that we got a few weeks ago. Over here, there's that sweet little vintage made in Japan dog holding the little silk flags. They are, each one of them is marked made in Japan. And on this side, that's the farm series. And there's the two little chickens that we got at the yard sale. And of course, another sweet Anna Lee. and more of the farm series. It's 
squeaky cabinet doors just like my squeaky floor. So this is my patriotic cupboard in the kitchen. I'll be doing lots more of the patriotic tours showing various pieces with some cute Ray Dunn and vintage and new pieces. I'll be doing the rest of my patriotic tours as I get things done. If you could only see the part of the kitchen that I'm not allowing you to see, you'd think, Lord, lady, you're never going to get done. But you know what it is. You've got to have a mess before you can get it like you want it because you have to just start from scratch, and it's like working a puzzle to get it all in. So have a wonderful day, and I'll see you soon. And make sure you hop on over to the next person's video. Happy Star Spangled Hop. Bye-bye. Till the next time.